Like mine. Oh my god, he's a lucky guy. Oh, no, we're not married or anything. No, he's just some chic. I was dating in Dubai. But yeah, that's totally over now. Oh, well, that's okay. I'm sure you'll find the right guy any day now. Yeah, I don't know if marriage is for me though. Like last night, I was having the most amazing sex with this AFL player. And tomorrow, I'm going to Hawaii with one of the Hemsworth brothers. So, yeah, I'm kind of happy being single right now, you know? Oh, yeah, no, totally. I remember the same feeling. I was having sex with everyone mm -hmm. until I realised I couldn't feel that empty feeling in my stomach with random men anymore. And then I found Ryan. <laughs> now we focus on important things. So I'm feeling really blessed, you know? Can I show you something? She's my baby. I've been showing everybody. Oh. Isn't she gorgeous? Wow. Yeah, I guess I just don't have time to focus on... Silly little toys anymore, you know, I'm just too busy growing life. <laughs> Puts things into perspective. Yeah, I mean, I know what you mean. Like, sometimes I wish I didn't have a job and I could just be like a housewife. But I kind of feel like I need to be doing something with my time. I mean, that's why I have my charity work. The Asia Africa Autism Fund. I'm on the board of that charity. My father actually died in Africa when he was helping children with autism. So, yeah. I also have a very deep connection to the charity myself because my baby has autism. So, yeah. Well, I'm barren. So, yeah. AIDS. I have AIDS. My baby has AIDS. And autism. Oh, sorry, I just... Uh, yes, hello? Oh, my God. Shit. That was my brother. Our mother's dead. So I guess that makes me an orphan. A barren orphan. So, yeah.